Welcome back. So we are leaving River Island State Park in Arizona, right along the Colorado River. Second state park I've seen today. Um, they're both amazing so far. But I'm going to take my park pass down if I can. Ah. risk any glare. I don't think it's showing up in the window, but I'll be sad if it is. I might need to get me some more ice. Icy cold drink. 89 degrees out now. Jeez. But we are headed south on Arizona 95. Um, to Parker... I wanted to sit in the Walmart parking lot and upload some videos, but I think it's too hot for that. I'm not even sure I can stop in courtside if it's this hot. I don't know what I'm going to do. Keep looking at stuff, I guess. Ah, Buckskin Mountain State Park is in half a mile. We might just call this put this drive, this one or two miles in the park video. Wow, this is our third. So basically I paid $75 for that park pass. To go inside of all these three parks would have cost me $45. So I've almost paid for the state park pass already, which is good for a year. Oh, this is gonna be neat, I think, I hope. Oh my gosh, I'm not sure where it goes. I just can't get over the river. It's so beautiful. Wow. So I think this is another camping area slash boat launch is my guess. <laughs> they have something called the fun zone on the map. Looks like there's um, 80 some sites. But um, yeah, I'm gonna stop this video. I don't know how long it's gonna take. All right, so I want to check out the um, campground. So this is Buckskin Mountain. Wow, their day use area looks really nice. Oh my gosh, it's right by the river. Picnic tables, fire pits, and I swear there's people, surely they can't spend the night there, I, I would hope. If you can, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Oh, there's a cool bar on the other side. Like you can sit outside and have drinks. This might be better than the last part.
Oh, uh, here's the boat launch. Wow. Way cool. And here's a bathroom. Some of these sites are available. That is way cool. I love the day use area here. It's probably got the best day use area of the three parks I went through. I mean, you have them right on the water there. Someone's got a hammock set up. Shade here. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this is way cool. I almost think I need to park. I am going to park in this parking lot. some video because I the driving part is super small I'm trying to find some shade The cell service is two bars on the truck and not much on the phone, so it's pretty much non existent. Huh, my laptop is not charging, that's weird. What happened? I think I turned it off somehow. It's hard to tell if this thing is on. Alright, it should be charging. Oh, I don't know what happened. If um, not sure what happened, I'm gonna turn everything off. Now. So they got a visitor center, our info center right here. Check it out. But there's the um, the river. This is Buckskin Mountain State Park. California on their side again. So Arizona has state parks. California has development so on their side. Look how nice that is though. No pets on beaches. That is neat. Cactus blooming. I haven't seen that in years. That is. So welcome to the Cactus Garden and Desert Tortoise Habitat. Oh, this is really neat. Oh my gosh. Prickly pear. That's how you can eat that or make jam out of it. Wow. Cigarro. I, oh, I think it's the same thing as the barrel cactus. I mean, look how tall it is. And these are blooming. Wow. This is neat. Oh my gosh, look at that. I don't I don't think I've ever seen that one before. Oh, and these get flowers on the top. And there's a desert tortoise here. Hmm. 
It's not moving. <laughs> They can weigh between 25 and 50 pounds, it said, and live to like 80 years old. Oh, that's neat. The beaver tail cactus gets little flowers on it. Wow, yeah, this is really neat. Never seen anything like this before. Oh, the Troya. This is the jumping cactus one. Like it'll get you if you get too close. And they hurt and are hard to get out. And there's lots of them. Yeah, that's the most dangerous cactus in the desert, the Troya cactus. But uh, here's the sign: Buckskin Mountain State Park. So they have bass and catfish and carp in here. I had no idea there was catfish. All right, the desert tortoise turned around. <laughs> he might need. He might be hungry. I heard. <laughs> All right, she was really walking. That's her home. There she goes. Go get their food. That is so neat. Oh my gosh. Oh, see, she goes to her bowl. It's almost empty. Let's get over here. She got some water down there. So they said she's like 20 years old. Wow. So there's the speedboats going by. Look how loud they are. I mean, they're hauling. Look at the water spray up behind them. But basically, behind that um, restroom in front, you could dry camp along the water, and it's first come, first serve. And I think it's free, which is pretty awesome. You just need a park pass to get in. That's it. Uh, there's the campground. It ain't got windy all the time. 